Hi, it's Steve the Nortel guy. I'm going to show you how to change the time on a Northstar Meridian phone system where the feature star star T-I-M-E time uh, sequence didn't work. So I had another video where I showed you how to change the time by pressing feature star star um, uh, T-I-M-E which is um, 8463. If you do that and it just sits there and it doesn't do anything, that means that your software is older and that that feature doesn't work. So I'm going to hit the release key to clear my screen and I'm going to start over. Okay, in this case, we're going to have to enter the administrative programming mode. That's done by pressing feature, star, star, 23646. 23646 spells admin, by the way. The password is also admin, or the password is 23646. If that password didn't work, it means that someone has changed it, either the installer or some previous administrator. You need to check books, notes, uh, check with whoever used to manage the phone system before, or maybe who installed it, to ask them what the admin password is. Okay, when you get in, uh, you'll probably see um, the screen say uh, one system speed dial. Uh, we need to navigate uh, to option number three, and the way that's done is with these navigation keys right here. This is backwards, forwards, and this is select, and then there'll be another key lit up here in a minute once I navigate some more. Okay, I'm going to go down to uh, number three where it says number three, time and date. I'm going to select that. It says the current time is 1322. Now it shows it in military. Um, and when we go to change it, you can either enter it in military or you can enter it in regular time and then just specify whether it's AM or PM. All right, I'm going to hit this key right here that says change. And it's prompting me to enter the hour. Um, the real hour is um, it's uh, 8 o'clock. So that's going to be 0, 8. I'm sorry, hit change again. Uh, 0, 8. I hit next. And I'm going to change the minutes to 40. And I hit next. When I say next, I'm hitting this key right here with the arrow next to it. That's, that's when we're in the program mode, that means that this key is for next. OK, is that AM or PM? I'm going to change that to PM. OK, and I hit next. And then it pops the date back up. I mean, the, And so if the date's wrong, I could either leave it alone and exit the programming or I can change the date. In this case I'm actually going to change the date because the date's wrong. So I hit change and it says the year is 09. Now that's okay so I'm going to hit next. I don't want to change it. I'm going to hit next. The month is 06 and that's actually okay. So I'm going to leave that. I'm going to hit next. Um, but the day is wrong so I'm going to hit change. I'm going to put in the correct day which is the 21st. Hit next. And then when it returns to where another chapter heading where it says number four direct dial or if it says something else, it means you've gone through all the menu options to change the time. Now to exit programming, we just simply hit this little release key. That might either be a small square red or a small square orange button on your phone that says RLS. You can exit programming at any time and you won't hurt anything. So I'm going to hit release. It'll say end of session. And then when the date and time appears, and you'll know you did it right if you see the correct date and time on the screen of your phone. If you didn't, just simply go back in and do it again. Thank you.